Hello friends, myself Dr. Himan Sharma and today I am going to explain you which branch is best in clinical, which subjects are best, which subjects have bright future or in non-clinical. If you are going to appear in a counseling and you are confused which subject you have to take in clinical or in non-clinical. So which subject has a better scope or bright future. So guys, nowadays new branches are also introduced. So firstly, I am going to uh, provide you detail about clinical subjects okay in this video i am going to provide you details about clinical subject and in my next video i am going to provide you details about non clinical subjects also but short brief i am going to provide you here which subject is better to take so guys if you uh, there is two things you want to earn money or you want to work for your passion okay so guys if you want to earn a good amount of money that means which branch is best you think radiology uh, guys but answer is different uh, the surgical branch has much more scope because a surgeon earns a good amount it depends on surgeon skill what type of surgery he's going to perform so ms general surgery is a good branch but you have to be very much skills you have a lot of skills a lot of surgery skills and also future options are there in MS general surgery. For example, you can do your MCH in uh, neurosurgery, in cardiology, oncosurgery, okay, CTVS, plastic surgery, trauma surgery, lot of branches options are going to be open after doing MS general surgery. But a lot of people try to choose a branch of MD physician. MD physician in medicine, this is also a good option, very good option, but uh, physician earning as compared to surgeon earning is a little bit low. But if you have a good name, your fee is very high and you are sitting on a good center, then this branch is also an excellent branch. You have also a lot of options like DM, gastro, DM, onco, uh, DM uh in lot of branches like endocrinology uh, in the rest pulmonary medicines so this is also a good option good branch but you have to study more one more thing ms orthopedics is also a very very good branch okay uh, but everything depends on your uh, interest if you are interested in uh, orthopedic surgeries like pelvic fracture cetabular fracture such uh, you you are interested to take this branch then this also a good future good options and if you want to do a uh, future like uh, mch after orthopedics in neurosurgery you are going to continue this is also a good option uh, and money earning branch is it and radiology if you have your own setup if you have your own laboratory your pad ct ct scan in everything is available then you are going to earn a lot okay so and if you want to earn a name and fame, then uh, your name and fame will be boost only in clinical branches like MD medicine uh, and in surgery. Uh, but you have to study three years more after that. Okay, uh, so your plan should be very much clear. If you want to become surgeon after that, you want to do super specialization, then these branches are for you. Family medicine is also a good branch nowadays and uh, one branch is PMR. Uh, right now there is not so much scope but within 10 years the scopes are going to become. And uh, one more branch that is emergency medicine. Yes, this is also a good branch. You are going to learn a lot of skills in acute uh, care and after that you are going to eligible for DM critical care also this is also a good branch but if you think to take anesthesia md anesthesia your name is not going to be boom after taking this branch you are giving um, because a lot of credit every credit is going towards the surgeon nobody ask about anesthesiologist which anesthesiologist uh, done even you are going to perform a very difficult case you give sedations you do management uh, but after md anesthesia you are able to qualify eligible for critical care medicine also critical care courses you can do and earn your uh, fame and name you can open an icu etc this is also a good branch then MD respiratory medicine if you want to stop there you can because you are uh, able to work like uh, a DM pulmonology 
similar work they are going to perform but the difference is in degree and experience and nowadays people like to choose super especially super specialist uh, so a lot of crowds are there in opd of super specialized and uh, this is a time where people want like gastro case they want to treat with gastric dm gastro or surgery by gastro surgeon mch so guys these branches are very good lot of scope lot of money lot of name and lot of fame everything is there you are even able to open your own setup little hospital etc if you are going to plan so money is there name fame is there some other branches are also here like trauma surgery etc you can take there is also a, a good future uh, but nowadays uh, not so much opportunities are there but coming 10 years you are going to receive lot of opportunities so guys uh, what about the non clinical branches like pediatrics pediatrics md pediatrics is a clinical branch is also a good branch a lot of money you are going to earn because every parents want their children should be healthy md in geriatrics uh, in old age uh, is also a good branch uh, but uh, in old age uh, family members like children they don't want to spend money on their parents such situation are also there so md in psychiatry is also a good branch if you have good knowledge your counseling is good you are going to earn good but uh, maximum name and fame branches are like md's ms okay orthopedics is an excellent branch and uh, general surgery is a good branch but uh, only as ms general surgeon not too much scope left uh, but you have to do future mch without that no nothing okay in coming 10 years and in md physician also same you have to do super specialization after that but md respiratory medicine is a good branch if you want to stop there you can and you are able to develop your skills you are uh, specialized in respiratory medicine this is excellent branch like in orthopedics you are specialized in bones and if you want don't want to continue like a, a super specialty then also your work is good your name is good lot of crowd will reach to you that is an excellent branch so guys uh, respiratory medicine trauma surgery also if you don't want to go further for mcs that is also enough you are able to uh, develop your future in that branch so according to uh, like palliative palliative the pain management is also a good branch for end stage of patient Mm, if you don't want to continue your dm then also your work is okay you are able to earn good name and fame in this branch uh, but nowadays not so much scope in this branch but maybe in future these branch are grooming okay and uh, non clinical branches also there like pathology md pathology is a good branch you can take you can earn a lot of money md biochemistry is also a good but like uh, anatomy, physiology, you are going to become just a professor. You can earn your money. You can live your life silently, peacefully. But in clinical branches like orthopedics, if you do some surgery wrong or maybe some complications occur, then your headache is always there. It is like as MD physician and respiratory medicine, your patient may be suffer. You have to also suffer. You have to think about your uh, patient and everything. So guys, uh, I already like a uh, pediatric surgery is also an excellent branch after MS general surgery. These are super specialization branches. One last message I'm going to convey you MD microbiology, everything you are going to become a professor, MD pharmacology, you are going to become a professor. Okay. So best branches are always clinical branches. If you do work hard, if you have a lot of headache, a lot of tension, that means you are going to earn good. Your name is going to be boom. But you have to do a lot of efforts to boom your name. You have to develop a lot of skills. Uh, because guys, one last message, if you are going to take MS general surgery, it's necessary according to future demand, you have to do MCH. Otherwise, otherwise, not so much option uh, not so much crowd you are going to attract maybe ms general surgery uh, lot of professors are there they earn good name and fame but they are old 
but for new generation you are a new generation you have to face new crowds everybody read on google with this doctor is a specialization for urology for urine and at sector genital urinary tract they go there and gynecology ops gyne is also a good branch for girls okay boys also can take uh, ent ent is a good branch but you have to do super specialization after that in oncology etc and uh, this is all about the summary guys um, why you became a doctor you want to become name and fame maybe you don't want to earn money uh, but uh, name and fame everybody wants and you have to give a lot of good care to patients so guys if you liked this video maybe your concepts are clear if you are confused which branch you have to do, take so this is the video which provides your complete details not too much detail i cover only a little bit detail maybe your concepts are going to be clear so choose your branch which branch you like take that branch only because if you don't like surgery and you enter in a surgery that means no future for you if you like surgery and if you took some physician branch then you are not going to do something good so firstly see what is your best interest what you want to become in future and don't forget one thing doctor is similar like a god okay doctor is not a god but a messenger of god lot of people came in front of you with pain and with their complaints and you are going to solve that complaint and in temple also people go and ask god please solve my problem same like you so don't run behind money always do good care and uh, according to me who is a good doctor last message i am going to provide you good doctor is not dead if you have a pain i have abdominal pain he give you painkiller medicine he is not a good doctor good doctor knows when and which medication is not going to use okay a good doctor don't know which medicine you have to take a good excellent doctor always know which medicine is contraindicated which medication you have to avoid he is a good doctor he is a genius doctor and who is a good surgeon good surgeon is consider only when who know who knows very well when surgery is not required okay everybody run behind surgery they want to do surgery they want to earn money they want to earn name and fame but if you want to earn your name earn your fame if you want to earn everything that means you have to be very clear when not need to perform surgery if you know this criteria that means you are a good surgeon so guys if you like this video put like on it and uh, if this video is helpful please subscribe this channel and if you want to ask some uh, doubts about your counseling about your subjects you can write in a comment section and uh, i will make a video on that also any topic you want to ask you can write in a comment section so definitely i am going to solve your problem which branch is a good which branch is not good and how to do counseling thank you good day goodbye